you'd call this an unboxing, although I actually already removed the box or the envelope, so it's more just revelation to the camera. I'm pretty stoked because I just got my package from the wonderful publishers of Hex. I mean, that is to say, Hex is the publishers. And this is the first time I've had a short story published in uh, several years, I think since 2011. And I don't write a lot of short stories. This is uh, only the second short story that I have written uh, other than uh, the one that got published in 2011 in uh, 20 years, I think. And it's called The Ibex on the Day of Extinction. And Jason Heller, who used to work for The Onion, is one of, he's a Hugo Award winning editor. He uh, has put together with uh, Josh Viola this wonderful anthology called Cyberworld. And I'm pretty stoked because it's got a lot of pretty amazing people in it, including, I mean, their stories are in it. They, they don't actually physically fit into the book, but Saladin Ahmed, Nisi Shaw, E. Lily Yu, Paolo, uh, and I'm, I'm not going to say his last name correctly. I want to say Basi Galupi, Cat Rambo, Stephen Graham Jones, Chinelo Onwalu, and uh, and more are, are right here in this, and uh, it is awesome to get these things in the mail. I mean, I feel I really do feel like it's Christmas morning. They also sent me stuff. You know, honestly, I usually don't like bookmarks and all that kind of stuff, but it's kind of fun to get these uh, bookmarks and postcards and all that stuff. And the best part of it of, of all is they sent me two copies of this great soundtrack and I know it's great because I got a chance yesterday I didn't even know it existed until yesterday and then I hit the I found out about it I, I clicked the preview tracks so that I could to get a sense of what it sounded like and this stuff is gorgeous music for those of us raised in the 1980s who love genre movies and who listen to the kind of work that showed up in John Carpenter movies that you know Carpenter's scores and also Tangerine Dream and all that electronic music of the period long before people called it electronica It was called electronic music and this sounds just like that if you love the music that's in the new Netflix series stranger things You're gonna love the stuff that's on here. So what can I say this this blows me away? I love this music already. I love it now I can't wait to hear the full-length tracks and they even sent me I think these are trading cards in fact I got to keep one closed because you know it's a collector's item, but I am gonna open the other one this is great. I collect your cards, or I don't even know what they, they call these, and it's a little bit embarrassing. I'm probably going to have to use my teeth to open this. Excuse me. Okay, good. And uh, boom, there we go. <laughs> this is this is the unboxing, or the un-enveloping, so we've got some, uh, some cards there. And they all smell like gum, which is really neat because there's actual gum in the package, which is, that's, that's pretty sweet. And the last thing is that, uh, oh man, the other book has other, I got two copies of the book, the other one has other neat stuff in it. I think these are stickers. You know, grown-ups allegedly don't like stickers. You know what I've found over the years? Grown-ups still love getting stickers. I was a school teacher for many years, and I know kids never stop liking stickers. And my little girls love stickers, but oftentimes grown-ups love them too. Last thing I want to say is that the book design is gorgeous. If you look on the inside, I mean, I, I really enjoy the fonts. And before each story, each story is fronted by this globe emblem, but each one has been uh, customized by per the story and its contents. So I just want to show you, you know... Uh, Mine, which is, as I mentioned, the story is called The Ibex on the Day of Extinction. And here's the graphic that these delightful folks did for me. And uh, that's also neat because there is a, a, a short um, Kenyan science fiction movie uh, that has a similar connection to that picture. So uh, what can I say? This is uh, just, There's a lot of other neat stuff happening that I can't reveal right now. And I hate to, you know, vague post in that way, but... But gosh darn it, this has been the best September in uh, that I can recall, actually. Lots of great stuff on the way. So I hope that you are having a great day, and I hope that you are going to do something that you think is awesome and that you will share it with other folks. And in fact, share right here.